NASA just released amazing 4K footage of the sun. I'm actually going to get off screen so we can drool at how beautiful this is. This is our sun. Holy crap. This ball of incandescent nuclear fusion holds our solar system together, and it's beautiful. Every 10 seconds, NASA's Solar Dynamics Observatory takes pictures of 10 different wavelengths, temperatures, and layers of our sun. In a star, elements like helium, hydrogen, and iron are found in the sun's atmosphere, or the corona, and each emits light at different wavelengths. Each color filter is a different heat level and wavelength, so scientists can look at the sun's layers and break them down. For example, this purple flash is a flare ripping through two layers, colored yellow and pink. NASA chose gold for plasma here. Purple and blue are active regions between two and two and a half million Kelvin. This is the first time we've seen our sun in such high definition. Now we can study its interaction. For example, we've never seen coronal loops this small. These tiny eruptions are hot magnetized plasma. Flare plasma is about 1 million Kelvin, but the flare itself can be 6 to 10 million Kelvin. By using the layering and the colors, scientists can show off how plasma moves through a star. But nothing on the sun is cold, so the dark spots are just cooler relative to the bright spots. Dr. Ian O'Neill, space producer for DNews, told me that he looks at this and sees the small sparkles rippling across the sun. These are micro flares, basically small scale flares that are sparked when magnetic field lines interact with and accelerate the plasma in a star. Fibrils are tiny plasma structures in the lower corona that oscillate like a shimmering pond. Large flares like these are unimaginably gigantic, several tens of earth widths across. But instead of rock and gas and you and me, stars are made of superheated plasma at millions of degrees Kelvin. This is a magnetic eruption called a prominence. The goopy stuff that you see it throw off there is called a coronal mass ejection. It's a stunning example of how magnetic structures filled with cool plasma can be so powerful that they're hurled into space. Solar storms can mess with satellites, affect air travel, and knock out communications on Earth. Taking pictures of our star isn't easy. Say you point a camera at a light bulb, it would wash out all the detail. The sun is even harder to capture. By capturing these images, Solar Dynamic Observatory scientists are learning loads about how the sun works, because honestly, we don't know that much about it. Regardless though, it sure is beautiful. Guys, if you wanna watch a 30 minute unedited version of this video, there is a link down in the description. Let us know what you think of this. This is the first time we've done anything quite like this. And come find us on Twitter. You can find me at Trace Dominguez and the show at DNews.